And the videos do not stop. They do not stop, Magnus Sites. Uh, Kevin Hart is now in a wheelchair. Let's uh, find out why. See what the hell is going on here. Yeah. Well, you know it's gonna be bad. Anytime somebody starts off by saying, well, it's bad. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the age 40 is real. To all my men, women out there that are 40 years old and above, uh, it's not a game. Respect that age. Respect that age. Or that age will will make you respect it. I was just forced to respect it. Um, this is just a public service announcement because I know people may see me out. And I don't want you to be alarmed, but I'm in a wheelchair. Yeah. I'm in a wheelchair. Why? Well, because I tried to jump out there and do some young stuff. <laughs> tried to go out there and do some young, uh, some young man stuff, and I was told to sit my ass down. <laughs> Shouts out to Stephen Wiley. I'm going to go ahead and put this story out there before you do. Me and Stephen, we got into a little debate. I thought it was serious. It was based off of I mean, that is serious and enough. Those that know me know I'm pretty fast. He's joking. Steven said, Kevin, ain't no way you're going to beat me. Steven is an ex-NFL uh, running back. Played for the New England Patriots. Very good guy. He's joking about it. Said, so bet. he's hurt, he but not bet. that hurt. Bet. We get out there, we go run the 40-yard dash. 40-yard dash. Guys, I blew all my shit. <laughs> my, abdomen, my, my doctors are torn. I don't even know what that is, but I tore them. That's the rock. <laughs> he knows. <laughs> Sit my ass down. This is 44. Wow. I'll tell you what you just lost, son. You just lost every opportunity of me going to racing you anytime, son. <laughs> it's over. Kenneth, it's over. <laughs> Sit down. <laughs> What are we competing for at this age? Why are we like what are, what am I doing? Why do I even race? I got something to say about this. Stupidest shit ever. Now Pat I can't you. walk. Cause I'm somewhere trying to get the title of the fastest nigga at the barbecue. <laughs> what was I thinking, son? God. Got to be the stupidest man alive. It is what it is, man. This is life. Uh you know, I'm out. I got about six to eight. I blew my shit. Six to eight weeks? Well. I assume since you're joking so much. Oh, my God. He does a second video here of him talking about it, too, apparently. So I got to check that out. I'm telling you all right now, respect it. I've told you young men that follow me 93%. Of my 1.96 million subscribers are men. I am telling you, if you do not take care of yourself, and both all bunch of y'all already do take care of myself. Trust me, you think you doing good? You are not. Listen, the older you get, you start getting stiffer and tighter. This is why so many guys in their 30s and 40s start pulling stuff and tearing stuff. That comic Sebastian something, that Italian dude, he ruptured his bicep in his sleep. I am, uh, listen to me. Stretch every day, stay loose and limber, and this too. Get massages at least once a week. If you can't, do afford that once a month and make sure you are water fasting or juice fasting several times in the year. You know when I feel like a literal child that loose to where I can jump up and run and do anything that I want? It's whenever I'm juice fasting or water fasting. For months, I will be loose and limber and not have to stretch, which is very interesting. I'm telling you, Kevin, you see this? Okay, my boy is boys with Naeem. If y'all see it, it's telling. Start juice fasting. Take, take, I'm telling you, start juice fasting. You will loosen up and be able to do all that stuff you want to do. I can get up and run. I might not look like I can, but I can do it. Trust me. But I'm telling you, I have almost tore several things on my body and doing nothing. 
Okay, reaching for a shoe. All right, turning off the air conditioner. Getting out of the bed. You all laughing because you know what I'm talking about. There's guys that have got up from the couch to take out the trash and ended up in the hospital. Let me see what this is now. Boy, you know what? Y'all, let me tell you something. I'm getting all types of calls. I'm getting calls from, from friends, athletes. Everybody, everybody starts off the same. Man, what the, what the fuck? The rocks is I said what I said out loud. What the fuck were you thinking, Cap? How you do that? Man, you're supposed to be in shape. Bitch, I am in shape. This ain't got nothing to do with being in shape. When's the last time that you have run an all-out sprint? I'm talking about a hard effort run. Give it all you got. Lip biting. I'm talking that lip biting. Now. <laughs> Hands like this when you fucking dip, dip, and you making noises while you run. When's the last time you have given yourself a thousand percent effort sprint? People don't do this shit. Not with the age forty and up. That's why my stupid ass in this situation. Look at this shit. <laughs> I'm going to send both of these videos to Scarlett. Guys, She's I'm, going I'm, to lose bad. it. It's fucking bad. My dick was like a thumb. And I'm, I'm swollen. Balls done got big as hell. Then shit went here. Balls look like a fist. Can't move my goddamn legs. Stop. All from on your mark, you said go. Stop. Never again. Never again. To every friend that has called me and that has laughed at me. Boy. After this six to eight week, when I get back to functioning, I'm going to light your asses up. <laughs> you know who the fuck you are. <laughs> mark is set, go. It sat me down, didn't it? Should have been on your mark, you set, no. <laughs> no! That's what the fuck I should have did. That's what I'm going to do now. Oh, God. Oh, how did this happen to you? You're supposed to be in shape. Fuck y'all. Fuck every one of y'all. Well, I am as impact. We'll be back. This road to recovery is going to be real. I'll document it. Goodbye. Let me tell y'all some 46-year-old shit that happened to me. I was on the couch one day, scratching my head like this. And I was scratching my head for a few minutes. It was itching. I ate something I shouldn't have ate. When I got one of those things, if I eat something I'm not supposed to eat, certain things will actually make my scalp itch. When I got up from this couch, my whole neck and back was tight. Seized up on me. I had to take ibuprofen. I had to stretch. I had to do every move, acupuncture, that I know to make it release, including getting Scarlo to massage me. Yeah, it's no joke. Stretch every day, eat right, get massages, and make sure you are juice fasting or water fasting several times per year, and you will stay loose in the beer. That rhyme day to play hate the game. Bars! 10 million subscribers. Woo!